Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hi everyone, it is an absolutely splendid day for football and we're looking forward to the game. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray at the microphone and sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And we have group stage action from the Cup coming up for you. How's it going to go Stuart? Well these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so important they are consistent throughout the group stages if they want to progress further in the tournament. Should be tense Derek. So the initial 11 for the home side. Well, the 4-4-2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front... Kane. Martin. Space on the flank. Oh, great block. And the short option preferred. And making the move to the inside. Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Turning inside. Where's he going to go? Surely! But he can't keep that effort on target. And a goal kick it'll be. looking attack and options in the center not really the ideal clearance could be and nicely parried away the concession of a corner here players waiting in the middle going forward well here can he finish well quite simply not precise enough from that position and a short corner let's see and he takes it on the crossbar got in the way Got the right idea with that pass. Oh, a goal! And every player's worst nightmare because this will go down as an own goal. Well, as you can see, it came off him last, and as a result, it will be an own goal. So unfortunate. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. Well, he hasn't had an effect on the game so far, but he looks like the one player who might be able to turn this around. I'm expecting a lot more from him and his team in the second half. How? Moving it forward. This looks threatening, but how well he did to cut that one out. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, we'll give him high marks. On and on he goes. And he's won the ball. This looks promising. He must finish! And how about that for a save? It's looking promising. Oh, a save of the highest order. Well, he got his angles absolutely... Great challenge. He got nothing but ball. A chance to whip it in. Can they square the game? And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Will he back? 
Able to skip past his man. And a chance to level it. Well, not on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. This could level it. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation, attacking though they might be. Still could be dangerous. And there it is, an almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, when you see this again, I think the goalkeeper's very unlucky. He makes a good initial save, but the ball comes off of him, rebounds straight to an attacker, and the finish is excellent. Four added minutes. Oh, could be. Magnificent goalkeeping, and still their level. Well, it's a top save, and it's an important one as well, Derek. That would have been it had that gone in. Corner kick played in. Well, it was a poor attempt, and a goal kick it is. Good mate. And there is the final whistle. An evenly contested game, and both teams will have to be content with a point here on match day one, Stuart. Well, a draw was just about the right result, but the focus has to be on the next game now. Both sides will be looking for their first win, otherwise, they could be playing catch up quality today. Hello everyone, the weather forecasters promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm very excited to be able to bring you live action from League Two coming up. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. It'll be a goal kick. Well, the fact of the matter is the home side lead the league in goals for the best attack in the league statistically. Will it? Delightful pass. Ball is loose and thumped away. This looks interesting. Can he put it in? Couldn't quite hang on. And the danger clear. Pulls it back. Tremendous block. And then. And Rose with it. It should be. And nicely parried away. And really closing him down here. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. And attempting the through ball. He's in behind the defence here. An early goal. It is the ideal opening. Well, here's the replay. And just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. of the other matches. Alex Scott has the details. Yes, it's a goal for Mansfield Town. They've scored the opener with 15 minutes played. There's no Opportunity! And they couldn't add to their advantage. Well, that would have put them in complete control. He should have scored there. ...room now on the wing. Now a shame that he couldn't find the target from there. Lewis 
So two minutes to be added on at the end. Dangerous ball. A oh, terrific save from the keeper. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Well, just listen to the crowd. They know this is a big chance to equalise. So the corner played into the box. A oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Behind in the game, but now they have a corner. Guthrie. The managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. An effective ball. Low delivery into the box. On his own with only the keeper to beat but he's missed it Stuart well he went for power but he didn't make the perfect connection that's why he's missed the target there I believe there's been a goal in one of the other matches Alex Scott has the details it's a goal for Steven Edge it's now 1-0 with 50 minutes played well too much elevation on the header but not a bad effort Oh, moving it nicely. They won't complain about having won the corner. And maybe an opportunity to increase their advantage. And they will make the change now. Elects to go short. Is it going to be? And power! Subtlety, he's hit the woodwork. Well, he made decent contact with it, but he has to score from that range. Chance to run at them. Now, will they be able to play it in behind the defence? It's got to be! Great reflex action. Well, that should have been a goal. Mind you, it's a brilliant save. To, to go for the bench at this stage of the game. Over it comes. Well, still an issue here. Kills. Nicholson. Making progress. Could be. Oh, striking the crossbar. You can't get much closer than that. Could be the final opportunity to snatch something. This looks promising. And a goal to level the top late on here. Just look at the reaction. Well, it's a goal you'd expect him to score, but he kept his cool and he put it away nicely. He'll be happy with that. And with that, the referee brings this contest to an end. All square here in what was a thoroughly compelling game. Stuart, your analysis. Well, it could have gone either way. I thought both teams were very positive, though, going hammer and tongs from the very start. And I think a draw is probably the fair result.
for most of the fans in attendance here have had to bring their umbrellas and wear their raincoats. It's a soggy day for this match. My name is Derek Ray, and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And our live coverage comes to you from League Two. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Moving forward effectively. Can they forge ahead? Terrific piece of anticipation. Delivering it. Well, threat about it. Good use of advantage by the referee. And threading it forward. He just needs to stay level-headed there. And a goal! 1-0. And what a fast start they've made to this game. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. And unfortunately, we did have to cut Alex off there. To confirm for you, the home side were able to find the back of the net. And they now hold a 1-0 lead. The cross is on. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, here it is again, and what a perfect cross into the box this is. Just inviting someone to attack goal. Number seven. So back underway, following the equaliser. Chance to do damage. Must take the lead here, and they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, just watch this again. It's a really good goal, but it's no surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. Jay. And how well the keeper did. Well, that's just exceptional. He reacted so quickly there. Trailing, but hope in the form of a corner. Now sending it in. How? Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, uh, what's the referee going to do about it? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Can they hit on the break? Well, apologies to Alex for the interruption. To recap, the home side were able to find the net in that game, and it's level now at one goal apiece. Well, he seemed to catch it on the wrong part of his head. I think they do have a bit more guile in the top third of the pitch, and that's been key to them leading at the moment. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Play was allowed to carry on, but that was.
was a tremendous save after a wonderful free kick. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Well, he's been a long way from his best up front, Stuart. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this, he needs to make something happen and start getting some shots away. Now I'm hearing that something has happened in one of the other venues. A goal there. Alex Scott with the news. Yeah, it's a goal for Port Vale. They're back level. It's one all with 53 minutes play. Thanks for the update, Alex. And do they mean business on this occasion? And it's gone in! The teams are separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, here it is again, and I don't expect goalkeepers to save everything at their near post, but on this occasion, although it's a good strike, he should do better. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in one of the other games, and Alex Scott can fill us in. Opportunity it is! Well, it was down to whether or not he could beat the keeper, and that question has been answered. Well, I'm all for players striking through the back of the ball with power, but he has to hit the target from there. A foul, but advantage played. Surely, and danger still. Well, they can't quite take advantage in the end. There's a slide rule pass and just has to remain calm and it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round well let's look at this again Derek because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and when he gets onto it he decides to go for power it's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. And he seems to have a bright future ahead of him. Hopefully it turns out to be a good move and he can continue to develop his career. There could be trouble here. He's already been cautioned. And his race is run. Yeah, he just lost his discipline there. That's a really poor challenge. He should have been taken off much earlier. has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. This could be it! Oh, what a fine save, and a timely one, Stuart. Well, that does give them some hope, because that would have been the end. Elects to go short. Dangerous ball, foiling them effectively. Can he open the door to a potential goal? Well, we really have to call that a squandered... Kane. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. And tonight by the post. And there goes the final whistle, and the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. And in the final analysis, a really positive performance from this man, Stuart. Well, it's a good performance. He worked hard, played well and scored a goal, and his team won. What more could you ask for?